Happy Sunday to everyone out there. Father Jared coming to you. I um, hope everyone is enjoying their Sunday. You know, uh, past week's been kind of crazy with my grandfather's funeral and just uh, so many things happened in the parish. And then also uh, Sunday can, is always a busy day at the parish and had my first baptism here, which was a great joy and a great gift. And, and you know, and but it's really important on Sundays for us to really take seriously the Lord's commandment uh, to keep it as a day of rest. And you know, because when we take it as a day of rest, we take time to slow down and we can really take stock of what's what's most important in our lives, you know, friends, family, um, and also a relationship with the Lord. You know, I think Sunday beyond even just uh, Sunday Mass, it's also an opportunity for us to take some time in prayer to just reflect on the good things the Lord is always bestowing on us because, you know, he, he does bestow so many blessings on us. And so I just encourage uh, all of you out there to enjoy your Sundays, uh, to take some time to really be with family, with friends, and also maybe to be alone with our Lord, uh, just to pray with Him or even pray as a family. Uh, that would be a beautiful thing. Pray a rosary or, you know, something like that to really emphasize the Lord's day, to really show that we rest in Him and that we find our life, our rest, and our peace in Him. Um, because it is such a beautiful thing that, that the church continues to give us and that our Lord gave us um, in having a day of rest to rejuvenate ourselves and to really just slow down and to take stock of everything that's going on in life uh, because there's so much that's always happening for many of us that we're always running around that it's it's good to have an opportunity to just rest every once in a while. Um, yeah, so just a little thought there today. So reflection today is a little bit shorter than usual, but uh, a few short notes. So uh, like we mentioned at Mass, we're going to, Father Hess, myself, and distributor, all the distributors of Holy Communion will begin wearing masks for the distribution of Holy Communion, so just note that that will be coming. Um, and then also this coming, so tomorrow, Monday, uh, which, you know, at 7 a.m. Mass, we'll have a meet and greet with me, and I hope maybe Father Hess will also be able to make it, but in the Mary Garden following the daily Mass, that's an opportunity for me to get to know the daily Mass crowd. And then also this coming Friday after the 8 a.m. Mass, we'll also have a meet and greet as well, so that way I can get to know. Um, yeah, there's people who I see at Mass every day, but don't always get a chance to really talk to or know all that well so uh, just an opportunity to get to know them uh, and uh, also next weekend at the noon mass uh, Archbishop is uh, I'm very grateful is coming up to install me as pastor of Holy Angels something I'm deeply 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 grateful for um, yeah just as one of those formal acts I think that's that's always a good way to start so that way we kind of uh, have that starting point in uh, a joyful moment uh, the parish this summer as we as we move forward and just to give us an opportunity to celebrate with one another. So uh, I hope that, again, each and every one of you have a blessed Sunday. Know my prayers for you. Please pray for me. And uh, yeah, we'll talk to you soon. We'll see you around. God bless.